Good morning, everybody, and happy Sunday. <laughs> I got Silly Simon on the show, y'all. And um, we're going to do this tag. Ask me no questions. I tell you no lies. We're going we gonna, to, um, he going to answer the question, so... You ready? All right, question number one. If your wife got pregnant after being raped, would you want her to get an abortion, have the baby, put it up for adoption, or have the baby and keep the baby? Have and keep it. You would want me to have the baby and keep the baby? Mm-hmm. Why? It's not the baby's fault. The baby don't need a father. So it's no need to kill a child. Oh, okay. That was nice. You got to speak up too, boo, because on, on the videos, people say they can't hear you. You can hear me now. <laughs> so if you ain't hear his answers, he said he would want me to keep the baby because he said it's not the baby's fault and the baby is going to need a, a dad. So, All right, question number two, and you need to keep the voice up just like that. Keep the very white voice up just like that. All right, if you caught your wife in the bed with another woman, would you be mad? Would you join in? Would you make the other woman leave, or would you leave your wife for cheating on you? I'm joining in. What? You going to join in? I'm joining in. (laughs) He a freak, y'all. Just let me let y'all know that much. Anywho, number three. What are we get mad for? Shit. Man. Because I'm cheating. I mean, like it's another. Well, what would if it was a man? Oh, then some other bastards will tore up. <laughs> oh, and, you ain't. And I'm done with you. Oh, so if it was a man, then yeah, you would beat his ass, and then you'd be done with me. But if it's a woman, you'll join in. Yeah. <laughs> Such a manly answer. Mm. Anywho, if your wife made you mad about something. Do you make her pay during sex by pumping her extra hard or no? Hell yeah. Light it up. <laughs> oh, so you do be lighting it up if you mad at me. Light it up. I light it up anyway, but I look, give me a little extra. Oh, well, I like extras. <laughs> you knew I was nasty when you got me. That's what I said about you. <laughs> Anywho, number four, if your best friend introduced you to his new girl and it was a female that you had knocked off before, a.k.a. you had sex with her before, would you tell your friend? Yeah, I would tell him. Really? Like you would say, man, I hit that before. I would pull him to the side and I would say, you know, I, I would tell him because you don't want no surprises. It's best to, you know, look, hey, man, look, um, for you, you know, I knocked her off, you know, I had not involved with her now, but I just want you to know, so it's nothing hidden from you, because that's what a friend should do. Yeah, that's true. Okay, but what about... It's up It's up to him whether he wants to keep her or not, but, right. at, least, but at least it's no secret, you understand what I'm saying? I don't okay. want no secret. Okay, well that's just like when, okay, we're going to keep it real, we're going to keep it 100, okay, when one of your friends... When some, one of your friends, buddies, cousin, whoever the hell it was, came with a girl that you had knocked off before, and you ain't tell me about it. Like, I found out later that this bitch was in my house, in my house, and he fucked her before. Even though it was back in the day and it was before me, but still, like, I need to know, if it's another bitch in my house, I need to know if you put your dick in her before. Like I was just going to say well, first of all, are you stuttering? Um, no, I ain't stuttering about shit. <laughs> first of all, I, I mean, I didn't even know she was coming over here. So what was I gonna say? Oh, baby, come here. Let me tell you something. I fucked her before. Come on now. Well, when she got there, and then even after then, she left, like I found minute. out months later. No, it wasn't no months. How later. long later? It was it? no months. Let's keep later. it real. How long was it? I, man, I can't remember back then. Was, was it the same day? Like after they left? It was close to. I think it was. <laughs> Sitting up in line. I ain't in line. Oh, no. But anyway, man, well, I was a teenager then. 
And then you talk, we, then we talking, we talking about damn near 40 <laughs> years later. Anywho, y'all, I ain't mad. I'm just saying, like, we're going to keep it 100, okay? That's what happened. I don't give a damn if you fucked her 100 years ago. I need to know if she going to be in my presence in my house. First of all, okay. I didn't know she was coming in your house. <laughs> anywho, moving on, y'all, because this is just really, anywho. But we just keep it behind it. Okay, yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, because we don't want to have no part two to the tag, okay? Yeah, part two and three to the tag. Well, anywho, because, yeah, we can have a part two and three, honey. Yes, we can extend it. Yeah, oh, okay. No oh, okay, because I keep it 100. They already know. Okay. I don't cut no corners, okay? I give it to them straight with and no I chaser. Care what, them, care what them people know? <laughs> <laughs> he ignorant, y'all. I'm just letting y'all know. Yeah. Give me a kiss. What's the next question? <laughs> the fist of all? <laughs> oh, I can't get no kiss. Next question. See, and I was going to give you some when we finish doing this tag. I'm going to get it when, I, when I'm ready anyway. Mm-mm-mm. All right, so let's see. Number five, if you found out that your best friend slept with your wife back in the day before you met her, would you still be his best friend or would you feel funny about him coming around? Yeah, he wouldn't be coming around. Really? Not like that, no, because I wouldn't, no, fuck that shit. But that was back no, in no, the day, no, no, like no. you said, it was 40 years ago okay. when you did it to that girl that right. was in my house. Okay. Well, but your best friend, like, you, this was before you. And it's, and it's still before me. And you wouldn't be his friend no more? I never said I wouldn't be his friend. He, I mean, he wouldn't be able to come over no more, watch the ball game and all that stuff? Um, At certain times. Oh, so he can still come around? Look, next question. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is ghetto ratchet. Mm, mm, mm. And double standards, uh, ladies. This is called double standards. Anywho, if your best friend met a woman and he was telling you, you know, you and the guys about how nice she was and how good her coochie was, a.k.a. pussy, mm -hmm. um, and then you found out that it was your mother, how would you react? Would you beat his ass? Would you put him out? Or what would you do? Because y'all guys, that's what y'all do when y'all get a new girl and well, y'all do it to her, y'all talk about it. It depends on whether he knew it was my mother or not. I mean, what if he didn't know that it was your mama? I mean, look, he was just being a man. Oh, okay. I, I mean, I might have some kind of, I might have some some type of feelings towards it because that's my mother and that's my friend. I can't just beat him up because, like I said, he was just being a man. And he didn't know that that was your mom. Right. Because I think if he knew it was your mother, he wouldn't have been in there telling all the, the gory details about how he flipped it and flopped it. And... Right, because if he did that, then I'd beat his ass. No, I said... <laughs> in my house, I'm... Shit, you losing. You ain't winning. You know where everything at. You ain't winning up in this batch. Oh, my gosh. Did I corrupt him? Or did he corrupt me? Because he cussing it and, and everything on the show. I fucked up. Anywho. Next question. Uh, we're done. The question is over. You're you're out of the hot seat now. Okay, but you double standing. What? You gonna give me another question? I don't have. <laughs> you better find one real quick. It's about to be some furniture moving up in this one. <laughs> All right. So let me find a question. Let me find a deep, dark, gory question real quick, and hopefully it won't cut off y'all. And this Sunday morning, y'all like it's early Sunday morning. We up here with this nonsense, foolishness, and foolery. Okay. All right. Let me think of a question. Um. No, I can't think what you making that kind of noise. I wasn't making it at first. Three. Okay, so let me ask you this question. Uh -huh. Have we ever been around anybody else that you screwed? And let's just be honest to keep it 100. I ain't going to get mad or nothing. I just want to know because that girl was in my house and I didn't know that you had screwed her before even if it was for... <laughs> God damn most. Talking like Michael Jackson. Yeah. That's how I speak, okay? Anywho, my house. You say, has there been any other girls? Any other girls friends? that has been in our presence that you screwed back in the, pa in the past and I ain't know about it. Like, you ain't tell me. Like, you, you kept that hush-hush. No. No. I 
time soon. Would you like if it ever happens? Like if a, I if, if if I knew somebody was bringing a certain girl that I've been with before, of course I would let you know. Yeah, back in the day, you know, yeah, I wouldn't. I mean, I wouldn't hide that. All know. right, but that, but let's just piggyback on this right here because you said you wouldn't. ain't know the girl was coming to our house, because and I that's didn't. not he, true. We we, is, we we nah, remember nah, she nah. was in our vehicle. Remember we picked up him and her at her house. Okay, wait a minute. I did not know. Listen, when we was in the car, when we took him, when we was all in the car, what was I, how the hell was I going to tell you I have slept with somebody and he in the car? Oh. That only makes sense, boo. Oh, he ain't know you slept with her before? Oh, man, oh yeah, that's right. He ain't even know he, he didn't, the guy, his cousin. Man, she done been there. We going to keep it real. His cousin didn't even know that he had fucked his girl back in the day. Mm. Well, before him, too. Lord, so he ain't even know. So if he watch this show, honey, he gonna know you screw his girl. Right. How you gonna know back shit? in the day, before yeah, him, but still. Yeah, that's true. Anywho, honey, that's it. The tag is over. Ask me no questions. I tell you no lies. It's a double standard with men. Wait a okay. Wait and, a uh, have, have have we been in the presence of somebody that you? Because you sure did speed up on that. <laughs> <laughs> Hell. I didn't speed up on nothing. You didn't ask me the question. You I didn't give me a chance to. I... <laughs> this is not true. Wait. Hold up. I ain't I been... Pre... No. <laughs> I already asked the question. I ain't been... sure? I no, I ain't been in the presence of nobody that we've been in the presence of that I screwed. You two have questioned all of you. can't even get it right. No, I get it right. I get it right. You can't even talk right right now. I didn't do that. Yeah. I ain't do that. You did that. That was you. Answer the question. I said, no, I didn't. I've never done that. Been in the present and didn't tell you. Right, fellas. <laughs> I gotta go. Bye, y'all. <laughs> oh, my God. That's crazy.